My shoes are so squeaky. I recently cleaned the floors. Also, didn't feel like putting makeup on, so I'm wearing glasses. I can't be the only person who does that, but my glasses do match my sweaty cup with my iced matcha. So I think that's pretty cute. Also, I have a huge zit right in here. Can you see the zit sticker I have on it? So it's there, acne is normal. Now pretend it's not there the rest of the video. So what are we doing today? Ah. First off. It is so hot out. Okay, okay, so. <laughs> sorry, my thoughts racing. Um, because it's so hot out. So I am making some homemade ice cream. Oh my god. Yes, yes. So, oh, my name is Pauline and I do things. So I got found this recipe from um, Pop Sugar Fitness. I think they posted it on their Instagram story and I was like, I would like to make some homemade ice cream that's dairy free really quick. So that's what we're doing. But let's go ahead and hop right into it. I got oat milk for the first time. I have never had oat milk before. At least I don't think I have. So I'm actually gonna grab a cup and we're gonna try a little bit of it. We're gonna use my Nickelodeon cup. Isn't it cool? Isn't it cool? Yeah, that's cool. I already shook this up a ton. Oh darn it, he spills the thingy on it. Every kitchen needs a pliers. Yeah. Now you might be like, Pauline, why don't you just use your hands? My nails are too long. Okay, I wanna sip. I wanna sip. It's like a wine tasting, only it's not, and I don't drink. The smell is nice. I think I like it. I think I, it tastes better than almond milk, like plain almond, because this is unsweetened, I'm pretty sure. Yes. Yeah. But let's get into this recipe. So I have this container that holds 2.9 uh, cups, and the recipe calls for two cups of oat milk, half a cup of nut butter, and a third a cup of maple syrup. I think that comes out to like 2.9. 0.5 plus 3, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, so it should fit absolutely perfectly. So we're gonna try not to overflow any cups like I've done before. I think I'm not gonna start off with this first because I know the peanut butter is gonna go like plop. So we're gonna start with the peanut butter. Half a cup of peanut butter. That's a half a cup. That's a lot of peanut butter. I recently heard someone on YouTube call people who like crunchy peanut butter psychopaths, and I would like you to take it back. Sometimes, okay, here's my logic. Peanuts are crunchy. Peanut butter is an oxymoron. Peanuts are crunchy. Peanuts are not creamy. They just pulverize them and beat them into a cream. They have a crunch. So why wouldn't I want to keep some of that, that essence of peanuts, that crunch? Also, it'll be really fun to have little peanut pieces in ice cream. Let's get to it. Ooh. Oh no, I already made a mess. Should I have used a spoon? Whoa, that, did you see it fall into the cup? Wow. Oh, today I was like getting my cup from here and one of the lids, we keep them up here, it slid out and it bounced on its side, the lid, and I caught it midair. And it was like eight in the morning too. I don't, I just woke up. Well, I woke up, it was more like 7.45. Because I was like, oh no, it can't make a noise. It'll wake up the dogs. There, half a cup of peanut butter. Okay, now we're gonna scoop this into here. Okay, I think that's as clean as I'm getting it. Peanut butter, you guys, look at that. Ooh, ah. So now we have the third a cup of maple syrup. Oh, I'm nervous, you guys. You might not have enough maple syrup. Oh no, no, no. You know, I'm gonna leave the maple syrup uh, upside down while we work on the two cups of oat milk, which I'm not gonna overfill because we don't have room. Yep, that's very full. Okay, let's see if we can get any more maple syrup out of there. Okay, it's not quite one third a cup. I don't know if you can see without me spilling it, but it's enough. Drippy drippy. So much of it just sticks inside. What am I doing now? Now for the next step. I'm supposed to whisk it, but I have my little handy dandy milk frother. I recently put a new battery in it, so it should be good or not gonna take a while. Okay, so the peanut butter is like lit up into chunks now. Maybe I can use the frother now? Yes. She is definitely arguing with the peanut butter. There we go. Yes. I still think there's some 
peanut butter chunks. It's pretty well mixed now. I think that's as stirred as it's going to get. It smells very peanut buttery. Now, after you've stirred all of that in, it says to add your sprinkles. If you want sprinkles, you can put like chocolate chips or whatever you want. They're just sinking to the bottom. Sprinkles. Check. Now I'm gonna do a little dusting of cinnamon on top. Voila, ice cream. Just kidding, we're gonna throw it into the freezer now and hopefully at the end of today, we're gonna do a taste test. This is like the first time I've cooked something and I haven't been able to instantly do the taste test. The lack of instant gratification is a little, like a little hard, but like when it's done, I think it's gonna be so. Well, I'm gonna pop this in the freezer. My dogs hear something and have decided to start barking. So I will see you later when we hopefully have ice cream either tonight or tomorrow I'll have ice cream for breakfast. Either way, I'm pretty happy. I'll see you later. Bye. I'm back. It's been about five hours now. Five and a half hours. I set the timer for six and I need ice cream now. I had a burger. I had a veggie burger. So be very glad that smell of vision isn't a thing because my breath reeks of onions. Reeks. But it's frozen enough at this point. We're gonna have some ice cream. We need to have some, I need to, I need, I, I need it. I need it. Okay, let me go get some fridge. Ta-da! Here it is. It's still a little squishy in the center, but we can eat around the edges where it's frozen. Solid. Also, all the sprinkles went to the bottom, clearly. Oh my gosh, you can see steam coming off it. Can you see that? Okay, but anywho, we're gonna get into this. Let's first crack it open. Oh my gosh, look at it glisten. It is time. I've got my tiny bowl and my spoon. Let's do this. I want you to be able to see this moment. I'm standing up for this, it's important. Can I even do it without setting it down? Oh my gosh. Plop it in there. More, more ice cream, more. I'm gonna leave it at that. I'm gonna stick it back in the freezer for now. Okay, we get a taste test. It's time. Let's do this. It smells very peanut buttery, very frozen. Ooh, ooh, it's good. Ooh. I'm trying so hard not to get a brain freeze. I get brain freezes so easily. Oh, I got some sprinkles. Yes, and some crunchy peanut butter. See, this works so well. This is so refreshing. I love it. Oh my gosh, I'm having a hard time stopping. It's the best part, ice cream milk. This is so worth the hit. Like, I can't even talk. <laughs> Joey on a sprinkle. 20 million out of 10 recommend. This is so good. It's so creamy and like the peanut butter is so nice. Like, and you can use different nut butters. I wonder what else. You know what would be amazing? I could use like Nutella. Oh my gosh, if you use Nutella? Oh, the options are truly endless with this. And it took really no time. Just throw the stuff in there. Probably would have even better if I threw it all in a blender. That's what I'll do next time. I'll throw it all in a blender. I need to end this video clearly so I can inhale more of this. But uh, if you like this video, give it a like. I appreciate it. Comment down below what other things to make with ice cream. It's like I can't even, my mind is racing so fast right now, I can't think of what else. Fruit, there's so many fruit options. Subscribe so you don't miss next week's video. Oh, next week we have a lo-fi video, so you can come and vibe with me. It's nice and chill, calm down, take some deep breaths, relax your shoulders, unclench your jaw. That's the goal next week. Follow me on TikTok, at Pauline Makes TikToks. I make TikTok. Um, you can follow me on Instagram, Pauline Does Things. I'm trying to post again on there. I keep forgetting, I'm sorry, I know. That's all. So I'll see you again soon. Make yourself some ice cream so you can watch this next week's video. Make yourself some ice cream. Sit down. Enjoy the little five. Five. It's a date. It's an ice cream date. I'll see you later. Mom. How have I not gotten a brain freeze yet? I'm paranoid now at this point.
All gone. 